Feud Season 1, Episode 5 Recap, The Insanity of the 1963 Oscars This was might be the finest episode of Feud we've seen yet, and it didn't have any of the really campy good stuff, Joan wearing a weight belt while Bette drags her across the room, that installing a coke machine on set. Visually, it was just stunning. The long tracking shot of Joan at the Oscars, as she walked from presenting Best Director on stage back into the green room to confront Bette is one of the best things I've seen on television all year. I know it's only April, but still, also, what about when Joan puts that clear shield over her face right before a little flurry of silver powder cascades over her hair, or when Bette loses and it's like a bomb has gone off somewhere inside her gallbladder? Wow and wow! This episode turned all of its awful, heavy-handed storytelling on its ear and into a positive. Hedda explains to Joan how so many people profit off of her and Beth being at each other's throats, but then Joan takes her outside and talks about how not being nominated broke something inside of her and robbed her of her self-confidence. It was shattering. Famous director George Cooker just comes right out and tells Joan not to ruin things for Beth at the Oscars. His speech was so sadly on the nose about how she is bigger than this. But then Joan turns around and says, No, I'm not, and sashays out of the room with a sort of self-possessed ambiguity that I have never seen before.